Hey everybody, Canuck here. Another Dream Team playthrough this evening. And we're back to Team Blue, and we're going to take a look at Victory Lane Sports and his Walking Stick course. Reminded me of Talking Stick, which I think is a somewhat more of a famous course in Arizona, I feel. Um, just reminded me of that, but it looks nothing like that. Uh, I'm excited to give this one a go. Victory Lane Sports standing designer. Again, as always, I will post links to all his courses down in the description below. Always known for immaculate kind of stuff. Really fine attention to detail. Unlike yours truly, who is real messy. Okay, what do we got here? Got like a... Like a up on a ridge kind of Delta-E style course. So was a course I always had in my head of something I wanted to design, something like this. A real neat look. That was my first swing of the night, and it's off. But I think we're going to catch the fairway. Okay. Ooh. Three little tiers here. Big green. I could see a lot of different options and strategies for this hole. Sure. A little. Just a touch long, maybe. Oh, yeah. It's <laughs> airmailed the green. All right, no problem. Shit no on. Ship it on, I should say. That had the distance. Ah. Yeah, we continue to plug away on these Dream Team courses. It's been outstanding quality. It's been a lot of fun to play these. Okay. Great view down here. The uh, the bay there. I love that. A wide open green. Rock works nice. Planting is good. Good. It's what we would expect from Eric, for sure. Beautiful look here. See the whole course opening up nicely. Good bounce. I'd love a hole in one on one of these. One of these playthroughs. Love a hole. Break now. Ooh, very close. That will take it. Good start to this course. Good use of elevation. Really like some real big up and down hills so far. Um, but handled nice. Sight line is great here. That bunker way off in the distance there, you'd think would not be in play, but uh that's probably going to be in play, especially with tail winds, perhaps. Probably not on this condition. condition. Certainly not with that shot. Found another bunker, though. Greens are real big on the bunkers. Not saying that's a bad thing. Just notice they're quite large. Quite large. Okay. Needs a kick left. Come on, baby. Come on. Felt like it. Thought about it. Thought about it. Come on. There's one. There is a beautiful hut, ladies and gentlemen. Yes. Apologies, I'm a little bit tired. I had a long day today, so apologies if I'm not my usual, slightly more upbeat self. Okay. A wavy this fairway, maybe, but... More natural undulations. We can cut, cut the corner here. Love the view here. Beautiful. 
Beautiful. Big green here. I'm going to try to play the slope. Be a fun second shot here. Try to play this and see if I can hit that little ridge there. Bounce down. Roll down. Oh, we hit it fast. Put all the fun away. Look at the little uh, lighthouse down there. Knowing Eric, he definitely put something down. Should we go Should we go explore? I feel like we should. Eric likes to hide little Easter eggs on his course. And that caught my eye. What's down here? I bet there's like a goat or something. Oh, just uh, something around here. Come on. What? Nothing? I'm a little disappointed. I have to say. Oh. I could have sworn he would have put something fun down there. Maybe it's somewhere else. in. Oh, I think I missed that. That was... Yeah, okay. Never mind. That was terrible. Okay. Oh, so there we go. Right. More kind of center line hazards here, which I like. We're gonna play over here. Oh, uh, elevation! It just—it's sneaky. It's playing tricks. It doesn't look like it's super uphill, but like that was quite up the hill. Okay. Needs that needs to roll. Get a big bounce. Huh. All right. Get in there. Nicely. Great course here. Really digging this. A lot of shared, kind of shared fairways. Cool vibe. Oh, the bunkers is bothering me a little bit. They kind of look like my bunkers, so I can't, can't really... Uh, I don't know, the edges look a little funny, but like I said, I do kind of do my bunkers like that. Not sure why they're bugging me. They're fine. They're fine. Oh. No rock in the gold, obviously. Old member attire. Keep the par train going. You have one birdie there on the third. Head to the seventh. Uphill, short par five. Other big, wide open spaces here. I like the bunker placement up at the green there. That's especially if the if the pins at the back, which I'm guessing. Yeah, over here, it's going to cause some issues. But a bit easier pin here, pin one, as I hope. Could be good. Get up there. Yes. Oh, baby, we got an eagle putt. Got an eagle putt here. So, no, I got it. I got it. Big eagle on seven. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, wow. Okay, double green. I was like, that's a deep green. Cool. I love this green. Very difficult. Definitely have to stay on this top tier. Like it. Got the perfect tempo. Get a bounce here. This is good. Oh. Thought maybe that was it. If that hits bounced a little to the left.
We have another putt. Yes, we yes we do. Eagle birdie here for the man in gold. Love the elevation eats here. Really like it. Look too far here. Played a little bait on, not on purpose. Um, try to hit block shot, maybe. Come on. She rolled out. That should spin a little bit. No. Got a shot for our. Th our Go four under through three holes. Oh, terrible putt. Great little front nine here. Like it reminds me of another course I've played recently that I cannot remember the name of. Okay. Okay. Um what are we gonna do here? What are we gonna do here? Thinking about, oh, never mind. I was looking up the right for some reason. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired today. Nicely done there. 21. I'll try this pitch. Uh, I don't like the pitch shot, especially with a uphill where it gets stuck. Play this a little bit long. Uh, we slow tempo a bit. I was going to say there's a really large um, bailout area, but that actually turned that into a tee box. That was a lot of people doing that. And using the, the big fairways is like not using separate kind of classic tee box. That looks getting used a lot more and more lately. Not something I've particularly had the chance to fiddle around with. I have. Okay. Holes take up a lot of land. Just a sprawling layout. I want to take a look at it. This feels like it just sprawls. That. That's beautiful. Great. Love it. It's perched on the cliff here. Uh, again, he's not, not using that water a lot. Can be a crutch. At least it is for me. Yeah, he's using, doing, using this very nicely. Okay. This might not be too bad. Big roll out there. This is camera setting. I was with. Cracking. Boom. Back on the birdie train here. Heading to the par 5 12. Still 550. Hopefully not uphill too much. Okay, so it looks like I kind of want to stay a little short. I don't want to be in the way of those trees there, so... I can kind of split them. Oh, jeez. Well, this is going to make the hole longer. In the fairway. Okay, not too bad. Got a good bounce. This is like just the club, perhaps. Let's roll up there if we hit it right. Like, R5. Give us some room to roll it up there. I think, admittedly, I need to work on more on my par 5. Some of my R5 holes in. It's that chance for to roll it up there, get it close. Hey, hey, hey! What about that? Two eagles on this course. Fantastic. Okay. A little. 
short uphill. Green does all the work here, kind of. Try the pitch shot. Is that going to be enough? Hit shot here. Kick. Oh, we got one. Ooh. Shot. Tapping it in. We're cruising. Holy cow, he's got three of the next four holes were par five. That's an interesting selection. So we had a five, a three, and now we got two fives in a row. This is a par 73 I saw too, which is interesting. Don't see a ton of those. Five. It's not usually what I get for an air course. It's like I don't can't put my finger on it. It's it's an amazing course. But it's like it's not usual like Boom in your face. Good. But it still plays like really good. This is gonna come down. We gotta watch this. No, don't stop. No. Oh my goodness, that would have been so good. A little bit more. It's not what I'm used to from a victory lane sports course. I think it's a bad thing. Still a more of an understated. The right word. Oh. <laughs> Get two putt. Get to double digits under par here. Wow, another short five, but way up the hill. Hang in the fairway. Sit, 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 sit. Yes, go for it. I think it is way up the hill, though. We're gonna hit this. Let's see if we can roll it up there. Got a fast. Okay. No, I tried for three eagles. Been outstanding if we had three eagles around. All right, we're torching walk and stick here. Just on a bit of a birdie eagle run. Such a good job with elevation here. Pushed it. Pushed it. Oh, that's really short. The terrible putt. Get up the hill. Oh, okay. That worked out a lot better than we thought. Uh, all right. Save the par. Streak it's over. All right, let's finish it up here. Slow off T. Fine. Nine, five. It's gonna be enough club. We're about to find out. Pushed it. Come back. Oh, maybe. A lot of fun undulations on this course. Ah. We're gonna put it though. Pretty hard there. Hit the pin. Uh oh, we're in some danger of our first bogey. No, terrible! I way overplayed that. So oh, we've seen enough of these courses. I feel now, like uh, we've seen some team red, some team blue courses. Who do you think has the advantage right now? Love to let you. Let me know in the comments there. I mean, unless it's blue. I don't want to hear it if it's blue. It's the wrong answer. <laughs> Getting up. 
Looks like great forces from both teams. Tough judges to do their job here. Let's see if we can finish with a birdie. Get her back to double digits. Tough putt here. Well, not that tough, I guess. Great finish. With a 10 under 63 on the card. I didn't really look at his clubhouse. I usually... Victory makes some good clubhouse. Forgot to check that out. I'm sure it's fantastic. Alright guys, that is our round at Walking Stick. Another great entry into the Dream Team contest. And another stunner from Team Blue. Next episode, we shift back to Team Red. And uh, we'll see what they got. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.